Hey guys, today's video is going to be an in-depth description on how this uh, combination lock actually works. Because I felt like in the other, in the video that shows you how to make this, I didn't really explain how all of this turned into turning that on. I mean, opening the door. So let's start off by looking at this, right? Um, the reason for these whole blocks, instead of just having a torch there, is because when we're trying to turn all of this off, if you just have your, um, sorry, if you just have your torch here, you guys do know that when you place a lever, it's um, like it spawns uh, in an up direction, right? Which would turn the redstone wiring on, which would turn this whole thing on, right? So if we get rid of this and place that there right that would screw up the whole thing and so that's how um, this comes into play um, so what you're going to have to do is oh by the way that only um, that only kind of accounts for the ones pointing up in your combination lock so the ones pointing down you can just have that there because that'll turn it off okay okay now we'll get into the inverter this inverter takes this um, this current and turns it into a uh, powered current, okay, which turns this one off, okay. Uh, just say if we muck up this um, combination, uh, the combination's up, down, down, up. By the way, if you didn't watch my previous episode, um, which only only put these blocks here if you're making this code because it won't work if you don't. You need to have those blocks only when um, it's pointing up. Okay, so the reason why all this has to be off is so this inverter puts it into a positive which turns this one off, okay? And so when you push the button only that one turns off. So you need them both to turn off. Um, if you don't know, uh, that's called an AND gate, and if you don't know how that works, go uh, and watch my AND gate video, because it describes, like it explains how that works. So, when we um, flick that, it turns off, which turns the um, inverter, it changes the current, turns that off, then when you press that button, it uh, turns that off, turns that on, and it powers the door. So that's basically um, an in-depth description of how this, all, ho as a whole, um, opens the door, and which I didn't explain in my other video. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Please uh, comment, rate, subscribe, all that stuff to show your support, and that would be a really big help. And thanks for watching. So bye.